All right, so looking at Dogecoin here, this thing's currently at 080. Uh, and you can see here on the chart, uh, I believe the last time we looked at this here, we we, uh, we drew this falling wedge pattern. It looks like you did break out of the falling wedge, um, but you have all the moving averages right here on the price action. So uh, I don't think it's gonna necessarily uh, go to the top up here, you know, Usually wedge patterns, you break out, you retest for support, and then you move higher. Um, so it looks like you're going to get stuck here at the 618, at 082. You're almost there now. You can see that the 200-day moving average is right here. So you may get stuck here at this price at 082 and just have a little wick up to that uh, moving average there. Um, you may blow through it also. I do not see the momentum at the moment. We really want to see these uh, lines on the MACD over this yellow line, the zero line here. Uh, and that'll show you that there's momentum in the market and you'll have those uh, nice fat green candles that spawn in like back here. So that's what you want to see there. But as of now, it's not uh, moved higher on there. So um, like I said, you may get stuck here at 082 on Dogecoin and then come back down to the bottom at the 786 at 068 so we'll measure this really quick so from where you are right now uh, about a two two and a half three percent move to eight two and like I said you may wick up a little bit higher than that up to about eight four eight five and get stuck at that moving average for about a five and a half percent move higher on doge um, but if you never make it higher from where you are right now and you just get stuck here you can uh, uh, be a safe bet that you'd probably drop uh, 14, 15, 16 percent, depending on where the price is, back down to here to the 068 price point. So, um, yeah, sometimes they just don't work out. It depends on the market. You know, if we were in a bull run, uh, a bullish environment, and you have a falling wedge pattern like this, then this thing would absolutely take off and probably come back up here to 15 cents or so. Um, but I'll just leave it at that. We're on the daily chart here. Uh, Dogecoin is in a falling wedge. Uh, it did break out of the falling wedge, but it's getting stuck at the moving averages at the moment. It's stuck right now. Uh, the 50-day moving average is, is right in the middle of this candle here. So you may even get stuck at this candle at pretty much where you are right now, and this just turned into a wick up here, and then, then it's going to fall down. So watch 068 to hold for support if you never get over 82 to about 85. And if you lose 68 down here, then you're going to come back down to the bottom bottom at 054 so just watch those couple of prices on doge and as always none of this is financial advice thanks for watching everyone peace out